praise the Lord, praise the Lord, praise the Lord, everyone. Good morning. We welcome everyone again to Everyday Communion with Pastor Raymond. And as always, we encourage everyone, go ahead and get your communion elements this morning. Go ahead and get your communion cup this morning. It's time to take communion and bless God. All right, we're going to open up with my uh, morning reading this morning. We're coming from Psalms 5, verse 12. Of course, we know all this week, you know, we're going to be talking about the favor of the Lord, the favor of God, my God. And we saw yesterday, according to Psalms 102, that God says it's set time to favor you. My God, I encourage you to receive that. It's God's set time to, to favor you and your household. And this all stems from a conversation, again, I had with my youngest daughter when we was talking about, you know, how kids always saying something's not fair. And I said, you don't want fairness. You want favor. My God, I don't want fairness. I don't want equality. I want the favor of God, my God. I want what God has for me. I don't want no, I don't want to be equal with no one, my God. I want exactly what God has for me, my for my life, my God. All right. So let's go to Psalms 5, verse 12. It says, For thou, Lord, will bless the righteous. Hear it. With favor will thou compass him as with a shield. Amplify it says, as with a shield, you will surround him with goodwill, pleasure, and favor. My God, man. Here's a, here's a promise for the righteous, for the people of God, that God will surround you. He will encompass, he will compass around about you with his favor. My God, goodwill and pleasure. So everywhere I go, I'm walking in the favor of God. My Lord, and this, this is for those, this is for the righteous. My God, if you're, you're in Christ Jesus, you're the righteousness of God, man, you should, you should always be expecting favor. My God, everywhere you go, you are surrounded with favor as with a shield. You know, even, you know, again, we are having this conversation on this, on this weekend with my youngest daughter. And then I love how God is so good. You know, we went to, uh, you know, they was out of school on yesterday and they wanted to go go to the store and get some things. So, you know, after, you know, first lady got off, we, we took them to the store. And and um, anyway, long story short, we was at the store and, and Josh wanted a charger for his uh, for his phone. And uh, so so the lady, you know, first lady swiped the charger, you know, or, you know, the scan, the charger, and everything self-service now, my God. The lady that worked at the store walked over and swiped her thing and 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 completely zeroed out the cash register and told us just go ahead, you know. And we're like, go ahead. She's like, yeah, go ahead. So you know, my family was like, do we need to pay for anything? She said, no, just go ahead. And I asked Hope when we got in the car. I said, is that favor or is that fair? And she said, favor. Absolutely, that's the favor of God. I <laughs> got you sitting there about to pay for something, girl, and the lady tell you what, go ahead, it's free. That's the favor of God. And everywhere you go, what? You should be expecting a favor, whether it's a, 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 something simple for a child as a charger, for a house, a, a car, a, a promotion, uh, whatever. My God, it doesn't matter. My God, the size of the thing doesn't matter. But all you need to know is that you are surrounded with the favor of God. Amen. Amen. Bless God. So let's go ahead and take your meeting this morning. Ooh, we bless you, Father. We love you. We thank you. For this another opportunity you've given us to come before your presence, to commune with you and with one another. We say thank you. We take the bread right now, which represents the body of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Lord Jesus, you was wounded for our transgressions, bruised for our iniquities, the chastisement for our peace, and our complete holiness was upon you. And with and by your stripes we were healed, therefore we are healed. And we're healed right now from the crown of our head to the soles of our feet. Everything you did, Lord Jesus, was for us. And for that, we say thank you. We do this in remembrance of you. And we acknowledge every time we partake in communion, we, we remember you, Lord Jesus, and all the covenant benefits, rights, and privileges are released on the inside of us. We love you and we say thank you. In Jesus' name, we take, we eat all of it. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. We take the cup, the cup of the blessing, the blood of Jesus. Because of your blood, Lord Jesus, we stand before the Father this morning, holy, blameless, the righteousness of God, without fault, without blame, in love, all of our sins forgiven, past, present, and future, my God, never to be remembered again, never to be brought up again. And for that, we say thank you, Lord Jesus. We take the cup, the cup of the covenant, the cup of the blessing. We drink all of it. 
And to that, we say thank you, Lord. Bless you, Father. All right. So let's go ahead and get our, bless, our blessing confession in this morning. The blessing of the Lord is upon me. My family is blessed. My marriage is blessed. My children are blessed. My house is blessed. My body is blessed. My mind is blessed. My finances are blessed. My business is blessed. My church is blessed. Hear it. Everywhere I go, everything I do is blessed. The blessing of the Lord is working for me now. God has made all grace, every favor, my God, and every earthly blessing abounds towards me in abundance on today. Amen. Amen. We encourage you to receive that, my God, that the favor of the Lord is with you everywhere you're going today. To the store, doctor's office, my God. God, no matter what's going on, my God, everywhere I go, your favor of the Lord is all around me. It's all upon me. Amen. Amen. Father, we love you. We bless you. We thank you for this new day and all you have in store for each and every one of us. We decree we're walking in the favor of God all day long on today. In Jesus' name, I shout grace, grace to every household that's watching online. Grace, grace to their households, their marriages, Father their families, their finances, every area of their life. We shall grace, grace, Father, in Jesus' name. We pray for all those who need healing and health and strength in their bodies. We shall grace, grace to your body right now in Jesus' name. Lord Jesus, you heal them all, and we decree they are included in the all, and we receive it right now in Jesus' name. Oh, we bless you, Lord. Hey, we thank you again for joining us this morning for Everyday Communion. Lord willing, we'll be back tomorrow around about this time. Commune with one another. Commune with the Father. Amen. Amen. God bless you. Love you guys. Have a blessed day.